Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I greet you according to your time that you're going to watch this video. Today we are going to show Agbada for all my returnees. Thank you so much for as many that will come across this video. Please, if you have not subscribed, subscribe or press the notification button. Support your girl. <laughs> Let my video go viral. Mm. Today we are going to show Agbada. This Agbada we are going to hold it two sides. Agbada. And the neck is going to fall. It's just the neck will just fall. You understand? That is what we are going to do today. So I took the measurement of the person. The measurement of the person is uh, 56. Then I add two inches to it. Two inches. So it's uh, 56. I cut it at uh, 58. Then I will fold it into two. You know, if you want to cut, measure the agbada, you see, you take it 58. Then you measure another 58. Then you fold it into two like this. Then you fold it into four. So that is it. Then you arrange it. If it's not arranged when you do it at the edge of there, if it's not arranged when you trim it, make it equal. Now this is the agbada. So we are going to cut the neck now. The neck is going to be a little bit far. Far from the shoulder. It's going to be not all shoulder, but it's going to fall because to cut off shoulder is different from this one, just right neck, but the right neck will be very, very wide. So this is the neck now, this is the fur. This place, you see it here. So I fold it now. I'm going to take five. In fact, I'm taking six. Six over. The wideness is six. If you open it, it's going to be 12. Then here, I'm going to make it for four and a half. See, then I'll just curve it like this. See, round neck. Back and front is round neck. Then I'll cut it. Then I'll take this place because it's like bad. I'll take it from the shoulder. This is the shoulder. I hope you can see me. This is the shoulder. From the shoulder to the bust is 10, but I'll make this one 12. Then I will mark 12, 12, 12 here. Then the, the freeness of the person is 50, which is 25. I mark it 12 and a half. 12 and a half divided by 4. I'm sorry, 50 divided by 4 is going to give you 12 and a half. So I will just take this 12 and a half down to the end. I'll mark it down to the end. 12 and a half, 12 and a half. I will just rule it out. Then if you have a ruler, if I use ruler to rule it, if you don't have any pair, that side that can draw it, just use it to mark it. Join it like this to this place. So if you are sewing it now, it's to this place. Then you take the, put your hand here. You see it? Use your chalk to mark it here. And mark the other side here also. Then you use pin to hold it. Use your pin to hold it. Let, let me cut the neck before I hold it. So this is the neck. And we're going to use patches to put, to make it patches, patches around the neck. You see it? This is the neck. I cut the neck already because she wants it to be very off. So it's not too wide. Even though it's white, she wants it to be off. Then I will just take a pin because I mark it already for it to be in a safer place. I use pin to pin it out. You bring out the front of the agbada. So now you see it. The side of it, you use pin to hold it down. As I'm using pin, now you see the pin. I'm using pin. I take after taking the 50 at the both side the you know understand then you use pin what well, I'm using pin so that when you are sewing it it will not shift you pin it and from the down here you use a 10 to open it twice so that when she's walking she will not go and fall from this down you see it's now from here you mark 10 here 10 is okay to open it both side you see, you mark it ten. Then after marking it, you hold the two sides of the hagbada. 
you pin it you pin it is better so now that i pin it now if i'm sewing it one side will not be bigger than one side that's the trick just pin it to the end so that where you put it there. Then, this is the neck. You see the neck. Then after sewing it, using bias, I'm going to use bias to turn it around. Then I'll come and put these patches. You see these patches? I'll put it. These patches here, eh? I took it from the two sides. You see? I took it from the two sides of the, the hangbada. Because we wanted to put knitting. There is no one can do knitting because it's an urgent work. So we have to remove the patches. And I put it round to make it full. You see now, I'm not even so it. If I arrange the patches back and forth, and I'll make it much here, then you see the beauty of the patch. The cloth will come out. This is the round neck. You see the way it is now. So we have a lot of patches here to put. Then after removing the side, these patches, there is little left over here which I can join to the side again. It's little anyway. The little border. Because after the border, we'll see it now. And I will join this to the two sides. I'll join it to this side down. I will join the other one to this other side down. Then I will make the patches a lot. I will just pack it around the neck. Then I will make it a lot. I will come and do it like this. So this is the end of the Agbada that we just uh, cut. Put, put your comments in the comment section below there so that each time I come, I'm going to reply you how you think about this uh, Agbada. Just please put your comment there. Your comment will help me go a long way. And when I get there, I'm going to reply you. Thank you so much. Please share this video out to your friends and your relatives. Share it and let them know that we are doing work. We are really doing, we are doing something. Yeah, maybe you want to learn. You can still follow updates and you see how we do the update. Thank you. See you in my next video. Bye-bye for now. Bye.